Okay. Hey guys. Uh, welcome to uh. Uh, welcome to the uh, video here today. Uh, today I'm here to talk about Moon Knight. Next week I will be there to talk about Doctor Strange for a review. Uh, Moon Knight review. Oh yeah. So personally, I think that this Moon Knight show was the best show that Disney Plus has put out so far. It was good up until the last episode where it was only where the last episode was okay it wasn't that good so yeah uh, we had an okay episode and we have lots of great episodes in the show I'm not gonna give spoilers cuz I really suggest you guys should watch it it's incredibly good uh, until the last episode and a lot of people agree with me on this fact uh, Moon Knight was really a show about uh, Stephen Grant and Mark Spector as they sort of go through some things. I'm not going to give any spoilers, but the main character is Moon Knight uh, and Mr. Knight. Uh, so yeah, really, I was already intrigued with the show. I was really excited for it already. Uh, I quite enjoy Moon Knight in the comics. He's quite the funny guy. This show was not that funny. Uh, <laughs> you were able to see otherwise uh, for character uh, for how much you would like these characters. I quite enjoyed the characters for the most part, but you know some people might not. I think what the show did the best was the Mark Spector and Stephen Grant. And if they do do a season two, like they've sort of hinted at, I would be incredibly happy for that. Uh, if you didn't notice, uh, they changed a tweet from uh, series finale to season finale. Uh, so yeah, hopefully we do get a another season of the show. Because uh, I quite enjoyed it. And sorry if I'm talking weird again. Uh, allergies. You know, stuff like that. I really... I really enjoyed the show for the most part. Uh, there was a lot of g good parts of the show. Episode 5 is currently my favorite episode and will stay as my favorite episode. Uh, which is technically the second last episode. <laughs> I quite enjoyed the show, and yeah, I was just sort of here to talk about, uh, you know, I, I I liked it a lot, and uh, I give my classic number review, so, well, here we go with the classic number review. Uh, I give it a, a, uh, a 8.7 out of 10. I think that this show was really good for, of course, a, uh, a show on Disney+. Plus. They haven't really done very good, which, of course, gives me high hopes for the upcoming Obi-Wan show. Uh, I have high hopes for that, so it better pay off for me, you know? <laughs> if it doesn't pay off, I'll be quite sad, because Obi-Wan is currently my favorite character in all of Star Wars. You better... Do good, hope you one show. Yeah, I quite enjoyed the show's concepts. Uh, I think I always have. And there was a lot of things about the show that I can say. Wow, that was a uh, that was uh, pretty good. <laughs> yeah. Other than that, I just hope Obi Wan is good. I'll leave you on the note that I quite enjoyed the show. Uh, it's probably the best one on Disney Plus so far, so I hope Obi-Wan does as good. And yeah, there will be a lot more reviews coming out, uh, especially since the first half of uh, Stranger Things uh, Season 4 is coming out soon. So yeah, see you guys then.